Our camera lens trained on one man. Well, Derek, if he's not closed down quickly today, he could score one of those special goals he's known for because he's got great technique. He hits through the back of the ball, it starts to dip and swerve on the goalkeeper, and it's difficult for the goalkeeper to keep... Hello, it's great to be with you, and no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Brentford, and they take on Arsenal. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And take it away. Well, here's how the lineup looks for Brentford. Well, plenty of attacking width in this 4 3 3, but they'll need to get their midfield players to join the centre forward as much as possible. If not, he'll become isolated. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the focal point on attack is Gabriel Jesus. Just had no time on the ball on account of the pressure. Had no interest in losing possession. A lot of excitement whenever Bukayo Saka is in the lineup. Stuart, what might we see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Options in the centre. Could go ahead. Oh, that's a fine save. Played over. And increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Terrific piece of anticipation. And dealing with the danger. Into the advanced position. Electing to shoot. Keeper getting the touch. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Well, as we can see, Arsenal have dominated the ball in the last 15 minutes. You sense it's inevitable the goal will come. It'll be certainly no less than they deserve. They just need to be a bit more clinical in that final third now. Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again, let's see. Well, after pressing like that, maybe the short route to goal. William Saliba. Arsenal get the advantage from the referee. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Mopé and threading it through such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure not a huge chunk of added time one minute and there it is the half-time whistle Away they go again. Second half is underway here. He's in here. Well, the break looked promising, but the danger has been averted. Being egged on by the crowd. And a goal to open the scoring. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here's the replay. And as you can see, this is almost perfect. Lots of curl and enough pace on it. The keeper had no chance. On they go again. And Arsenal know they need to wipe out that last goal. 
A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage with Arsenal. Happy birthday to Sasha. We're looking at celebrating today. From Martinelli. And Here's Havertz. And we'll take efforts like that all day long. And it will be an Arsenal free kick. Jensen. Well, we're into the final half hour. Oh, he'll take it on. Brilliant save. Martinelli. Declan Rice. Chance maybe to use their counter-attacking ability to good effect. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, this looks really productive. What can they do from this position? Opportunity it is. Wow, that is high-level goalkeeping. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. That's goalkeeping of the highest quality, I would say. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And a goal to really bolster things for them. Two in front. Well, let's look at this again. It's a decent delivery into the box, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. So, 2-0 now. William Saliba. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. And it's Gabriel Jesus. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Arsenal's free kick here. Number six, Christian Morgan. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Kai Havertz. Marcinelli. Opportunity. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. Well, they've decided to make a change. Who's going to get on the end of it? Good clearance. Determined defending. Now, options are plenty. Havertz. A very effective challenge put in. And playing it through. And it took a little nick before it went over the touchline. So a throw in here. And there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good...